Good morning. It's so bright and sunny today. It's 70 degrees, so I'm a little bit overdressed. I wanted to do another what I eat in a week video, but then I realized last time that I did it, I had 50 plus hours of footage and I just couldn't edit all of it. So I'm thinking of doing what I eat in a weekend this time around. I'm meeting up with James right now. We're going to a vegan burger place. I've never had Hip City Veg, but I'm kind of excited to try. And the reviews are good, so we'll see. Can I try it? Mm. It's good, right? Mm. Awesome. Mm. That tastes so much like chicken. What should we do now? All the little ones just trying to like play with them. <laughs> oh, why are you so left out? Hey, can someone please give this to another one? Puppy to play. Story in two parts. Oh, that's what they're playing. Day in the life. Of what? Llama? Of a llama. James is walking me to dinner. I'm meeting up with a friend um, at a Peruvian place. And it is three dollar signs on Google. Uh, what is it? Google? Google. On Google. <laughs> on Google. Um, so I'm kind of worried about the menu and price. But we'll see how it is. And I'm not actually eating there. Oh yeah, he's just walking me. I'm trying to save money. <laughs> Sorry, I missed. <laughs> mm. oh. It's good. Not what I thought it would taste like. That's the pistachio, right? No, I gave you the cookie dough. Oh, you did. Mm -hmm. Wait, the pistachio is really good too. for lunch today because we are doing a meal kit from HelloFresh. HelloFresh is kindly sponsoring this video, so thank you HelloFresh. The recipe that I'm going with is balsamic tomato and herb chicken. This is what it looks like. I think the first thing that we want to do is take the cilantro and the tomatoes and cut it. For those of you who don't know what HelloFresh is, HelloFresh is America's number one meal kit service. Their recipes are super delicious and they feature produce that goes from the farm to your front door in under a week, which basically means that their spring menu features all of the season's freshest flavors. The other thing I really like about HelloFresh is that it's super effortless. It saves time, money, and stress, and it is 
72% cheaper than dining at a restaurant. With meal kit services, the ingredients are pre-portioned, so they really help to cut out prep time, prevent food waste, and to make sure that I am on budget for my meals. The nice thing about HelloFresh is they also offer veggie, pescatarian, and fit and wholesome meals to basically make it easy for you to stick to your goals. And even then, you don't sacrifice any of the flavors so you can maintain your goals and feel good about your food choices while eating well. And the last thing I did want to acknowledge is that HelloFresh helps you to eat more sustainably. So they are the first carbon neutral meal kit company. Nearly all of their packaging is recyclable. And whenever you use HelloFresh, you're basically cutting down your food waste by at least 25% compared to regular grocery shopping. If you guys are interested, you can go to HelloFresh.com and use my code TheraPan16 for 16 free meals and three surprise gifts. So now I'm just finishing up the cooking process, but this looks really good so far and I'm super excited to eat this. Okay, we have the spaghetti and just a taste test time. Mix up the flavors. I always love HelloFresh meals, so I have no doubt that I'm gonna like this, but I, let's see. Mmm, mmm. -hmm. It's super good. Also very hearty, carby. I've entered my for the same song over over again. <laughs> I'm gonna say this song. All right, Kyle, tell me how you feel. About how do this. I eat this? I don't know. Oh, you should probably spread this sauce. No? Oh, okay, okay. Oh! <laughs> it's actually pretty good though. Yeah? Yeah. There's a lot of vinegar, so I'm worried the taste, but... Well, you know I love vinegar. Oh, I know you do. That does look really good, huh? I know, look the at that. The lighting? I can't tell if this seems too, like, sleepwear -y. I'm rushing to the L right now because I am getting dinner with a friend, Julia. The weather's kind of bad today, so I have my umbrella. We're going to the East Village to get Japanese, I think. The place is called Kimura. I'm excited, and it's still raining right now. I think we decided to wear heels today. This was a really bad decision. We're having a late lunch today because I had to run some errands this morning, so we're very behind on schedule. So I thought to do something quick, and the only thing I could think of was using my steamer. So this is the plan. I want to do frozen dim sum, uh, steamed Brussels sprouts, and steamed buns. Thankfully, I'm not making this from scratch. So we have the infamous Kirkland Signature Costco brand uh, dim sum. Those of you who don't know what a steamer is, it's basically this contraption that you fill up with water at the very base and then it essentially does what it sounds like, like steaming your food. So growing up, my mom always cooked things in the steamer, like dumplings or egg custards and different meals like that. But you can do so many things. I should not be waving this around. But you can do so many things with a steamer. Like the one that I have, you can steam stuff, slow cook stuff, and make yogurt. And then I'm a little bit weird in that I really like to mix sweet and salty things. So I'm gonna add just a tiny bit of honey. But this is our Brussels sprouts.
In the meantime, I also want to make some tea. I don't have loose leaf tea, which I should probably get some. I have green tea for now. Um, and it's already in this packet, but my this water bottle that I have is actually a tea infuser. So I'm just gonna throw it in the little tea slot. Pop it in. And I'm gonna let it just infuse in here. And I think my food is ready. It is so late right now and I'm starving. All right, this is lunch and it looks very, very healthy. But we're finally eating. I don't know why, but every single time I make this, the soup is just, I don't know where the soup goes. It's not in the plate either, so I'm really confused. I think I'm trying to suck something out, but there's nothing coming out. I'm so bad. Let's try the Brussels sprouts. Hmm, not bad. I think I could have added a little bit more soy sesame sauce, or actually, I think soy sauce would have gone really well. This. steamed egg this is a classic my mom used to make this for me every single morning for breakfast and mine is actually a little bit overcooked so i did put it in the steamer for too long so it looks a little bit lumpy but it's still gonna taste good and then if you watched my last what i eat in a week video i already showed you guys this but this is these are tacos from my absolute favorite taco place Ever. they're called hob this is not sponsored in any way but i just love this place so much i think james and i get birria tacos from hob probably every other week if not every single week uh because they're that good oh my god that is so good Mm, mm, mm. probably gonna just watch some netflix and then finish the rest of this up thank you guys so much for watching if you have any food racks like new york city food racks or just cooking racks definitely let me know because i'm always on the hunt for really good food but otherwise thank you guys for watching i hope you're having a wonderful day and i will catch you guys in the next video peace